It's been a while. Let's get this Tuesday in motion. Today we install fours and verify that it works. For F4SE to detect what it needs to, you need to have launched your game at least one time before installing it. A fresh script extender installation requires your game version to be up to date. The F4SE website shows what version is needed. To see what version you have, open the game folder, locate and right click the game's executable, properties, details tab, locate product version. Script Extender page, current build, 7-zip archive link. Open the archive that is downloaded. Open the Fours folder. In the second window, open the game folder. Drag and drop the files inside. Open MO2. Fours should be auto-detected. If not, open Modify Executables. Add Executable. Add from File. Navigate to the game folder and double-click the Fours executable. Title is whatever you like. Apply. OK. Dashboard. Fours should be auto-detected. If it isn't, add tool. Name is F4SE. Folder next to target. Game folder. Double-click the Fours executable. Save. From now on, launch the game from here. At the game menu, push the tilde key to open the console. Different language keyboards may require different keys. Type the following, get F4SE version. Push enter. If any version is returned, the script extender is working. If not, recheck your steps. Creation Club updates also update the game's executable. There may even be times when it updates other files. When this happens, force breaks. And so do some mods. I've created a video on how to avoid this issue, and I've linked it. Take care of yourselves. I'll see you soon.